today I am getting a micro needle facial today as you can see I have acne scars um I had one session of micro needling and it helped a lot with my acne scars they were a lot darker and more pigmented but now they're a lot lighter and more pink usually you have to go for another session so this is gonna be my second session I think I'm gonna do a third one and then stop depending on how my marks look but yeah i'm excited for my facial today it was a very great experience my makeup routine is as natural as possible i try not to go too heavy with makeup this is what i usually do when i go to the gym and uh, if you are one of those people that like to wear makeup to the gym then uh, go right ahead and wear your makeup you want to feel pretty feel pretty you want to look good look good you look good to feel good in the gym you want to throw on a cute outfit throw on a cute outfit no matter what anybody says you are your own person and nobody can tell you what to do do what makes you happy if you want to do a full glam to the gym go ahead and do that sis you don't need anybody's permission you don't need anybody's judgment you can do whatever you want i'm just preaching that because i know some people are gonna be like oh you wear makeup to the gym i don't like okay usually in the summer i don't even bother with foundation but since you know it's that season where you get extra pale i want to look a little bit more bronzed so i'm just gonna prime my face today i um having a super chill day it is halloween eve and i have no plans i'm literally a introvert i don't like to go out that much i not even that much i don't go out at all i don't even remember the last time i went outside like out partying or drinking or going out um the last time i went out for dinner was with my boyfriend and his family for his birthday you know i don't really care about celebrating halloween but i do care about thanksgiving and christmas like i love thanksgiving because of the food and christmas i love the festive like the holiday the christmas trees the presents it's very special to me because all your family gets together and celebrate the holiday it is very special and it's such a pure moment the only thing i really like about halloween is that it lands in the fall i love fall colors like the autumn leaves changing fall decor decorating your home dressing up for halloween is not really my thing yeah i don't have plans for today tomorrow is halloween and tomorrow i'm probably just gonna go um shopping for bedding and pillows because my bed just came in and i need a bedding set and a bunch of throw pillows and i think i already have a throw blanket if it matches i'll put it on you know if it complements it but yeah i'm just throwing on some foundation nars natural radiance foundation if i miss something please feel free to comment down below and i'll tell you guys what i use if you have any other 
video suggestions please comment down below so i can do it i know you guys want to see what i eat in a day i will definitely film that very soon it'll probably be after this video i'm still very new to youtube and i just need help with some ideas i already have a lot of ideas in my head but you know it's good to have you know other people's suggestions and thoughts um speaking of what i eat in a day i'm thinking about i'm actually gonna go into a bulk and i'm thinking about doing meal preps but my thing is like meal prepping people don't talk about this but meal prepping is almost like eating the same foods almost every day I think I might go into switching around maybe different meals all day cooking like three different meals is pretty you know time-consuming which I understand because at one point I tried to meal prep consistently but then I stopped I feel like I rather cook different meals and eat them as I go plus I like freshly cooked meals like i don't like eating leftovers but sometimes i just eat leftovers so that i don't have to cook again i always like trying new things and uh, eating different varieties of meals and foods um so i don't get bored <laughs> of eating the same old same old but yeah i'm thinking about gaining about one pound a month i'm thinking about one pound because i don't want to gain fat excessively way too fast i made that mistake in the beginning of my journey when i wanted to gain weight when i was very skinny and i had a low body fat percentage this was um before i gained my weight i would eat a whole lot of food and eat whatever i want i would stuff my face and it, like have like tons of protein shakes and mass gainers and all of that and i ended up gaining weight way too fast that i was looking extra puffy i felt very bloated all the time i just did not feel good about myself i felt self-conscious looking in the mirror i wasn't lean like i am now and the funny thing is this is why i'm going to say the scale doesn't matter i'm weighing the same weight i weigh now from when i felt that way i'm weighing the same weight but i'm a lot leaner now which is crazy because how the body works is insane if you are weighing yourself and you're losing body fat but you're gaining muscle right and let's say you gain like three pounds four pounds five pounds whatever it is during that process but you look leaner and more defined but you look at the weight and it's heavier do not rely on that that is false rely on what you look like in the mirror rely on how you feel if you're feeling good then that's a good sign take pictures take before and afters if you look at those before and after results you'll see and the scale is not really a reliable source but my point was that i'm trying to bulk <laughs> and i am a bit um scared to do a massive bulk so i'm going to take my time on bulking this winter and taking my time on cutting down after i feel like my makeup is taking a lot longer because i'm chatting but i love talking on the camera i'm getting used to it i like to bulk during the winter time some people bulk all year long but it doesn't have to be a crazy bulk like i said it can be a lean bulk a slight bulk uh slight caloric surplus you know you don't have to go crazy unless you are skinny and you have a really low body fat percentage just take your time and you know work around your goals and uh, do not rush anything time is precious and results happen over time not overnight Take your time, see what works for you. If it doesn't work for you, try something different. It's always a trial and error process in your fitness journey. I put on foundation, filled in my brows, the sparse areas. If I'm going with a full gram, I'll definitely conceal under my brows and I'll put more foundation on, I'll put more concealer on. Um, I'll bronze 
a bit more and I'll put on blush but today I'm going to put on blush because I love that brush look but very lightly today very lightly I did not know my camera needed to cool down like if I knew this I would have never got the camera I looked at other people's reviews and they said the same thing so that tends to happen when you're recording for a while but Hopefully it doesn't happen a lot or faster. I'm just lining my lips and rubbing it in. This is the color Foxy Brown in Chateau Berry Lip Cheat. And then I go over it with Vaseline Lip Therapy and Rosy Lips. It gives it a little light blush tint. It's very light, everything. It's not so crazy. I try to go as natural as possible. I like to do my makeup for the gym because it gives me a confidence boost and it makes me feel pretty and makes me feel good for the gym. And now I'm going to go extra hard on leg day. <laughs> I'm going to walk my dog now before I head to the gym. But before I do, I want to show you guys my living room so far. I got a new couch, a TV stand, and the rug. And... I decorated a little bit but this is the living room so far got my pillows I just got these two pillows yesterday from Target that pillow there is home goods this pillow behind here is Target and then a Target blanket throw um yeah this is the TV stand we're thinking about putting the TV on the wall if it's okay with our landlord I just got the Pampa grass yesterday and look how pretty she is. I need to put her in a different vase because I feel like the head is too um, wide for the um, stems. So who knows? Maybe I'll leave it there. Should I leave it there, guys? Or different vase? I don't know. I have um, a basket here with an extra blanket and then my rug it has dark spots because every time my people walk on it it creates dark spots in it which i don't mind every rug is like that except for the ones that aren't furry like my puppy here hey your baby he's ready to go he knows i'm gonna take him soon I also have this area here, this console table, it ended up being too big for this corner. And these are a bunch of decor that I bought so far. This is for Christmas. I'm already shopping for Christmas. <laughs> but yeah, I got some candle holders, some candles. This is for Thanksgiving, giving me Thanksgiving vibes. It smells like pumpkin spice. And the beads the candles and this book that i got from amazon called look beautiful this is my bed this is a linen bed that i got from wayfair it is called amira bed it is king size and then i got he follows me everywhere look at him <laughs> so cute what happened what's your matter and then a bench in the front uh, it is a Sherpa bench, so it has that Sherpa material, this pillow, random pillow here. I had to get bedding from my bed. I don't have bedding just yet, but I'm going to go with white blankets and throw pillows. I put our blanket here for now. Yeah, so there's storage in there. So this is the bed that we have that took a month to come in. So I just walked my dog, my camera battery died, both my batteries died, so I'm using my phone, but I am wearing the copper outfit leggings on our active hoodie. I tucked it into my sports bra and my Converse. I'm about to tie up my hair in a clip, and I'll show you guys that real quick. I'm going to set you guys up right here. Oh, so... I'm just going to spray my baby hairs real quick. Oh, I think I got it on my face. Okay. 
then I'm out of breath because I just walked my dog and he gave me a hard time when he saw another dog. He absolutely loves other dogs. So every time he sees another dog, he wants to meet them so bad. And I'm like, Zeus, you can't meet every dog you see. But how I clip my hair, I'm just gonna brush everything back. Every time I put my hair up, it's so hard because my upper body feels sore from yesterday. So it's like so hard to tie it up because my arms get tired. And then I'm going to twist my hair up. Boom. And then I hold this piece up here, wrap the hair around, hold the end piece, and clip. There you have it. So now my hair is clipped up. I'm going to take out a front piece right here, like so. Oh, my front pieces are frizzy, but I'm just going to take it out like this. Then brush it again. And I am ready. <gasps> my earrings. How could I forget my lucky earrings? I'm always wearing these earrings to the gym. I love them. They're my everyday earrings. I got them from Misguided and I'm gonna have to get more because the color is starting to wear off. They're not real earrings. I am ready. Um, let me get my pre-workout ready now. I'm going to have, which one? You know what, let's go with Sour Peach Candy. I've been loving that one lately. And of course, creatine, true creatine. Um, I'm gonna have one scoop of the Prolific because I had coffee this morning. And then one scoop of the high volume so I get the full pump ingredient. And then, by the way guys, look at my new dish set. It's so cute. I love it. I got this from Bed Bath & Beyond. It's called Neurotake Just Shit. It's a clay color and I love it. It kind of reminds me of a mocha color. But I think it's a clay color truo duo. It is stackable so you can stack them up and organize. Super cute. I don't have that many dishes but I have some to, you know, use for now. I want to get tall glasses though, so I can put my shakes in. I want to start making green shakes and green juices, so I need to get a juicer. I used to juice a while back while I worked at a smoothie bar. I always used to have a juice every day, but I don't have a juicer, so I definitely want to get one. I forgot to close my cabinets. <laughs> But yeah, I'm having prolific, high volume, and true creatine, one scoop of each. And this is usually what I take pre-workout. Um, sometimes I go with prolific, two scoops, and no high volume at all. But high volume is the non-caffeinated one. It's a pump formula though, so it gives you the pump that pre-workout gives you, but without the caffeine. So. If you don't like taking caffeine or drinking caffeine, then this is for you. This one is the one with caffeine. The serving size is two scoops. Um, I like this one because it does not make me itchy. So I usually do around eight ounces of water, one scoop of each. Mix it up with my straw. I love these metal straws. I got them from Target and it comes in a bunch of different colors. I used to dry scoop, but now that I put creatine in it, 
I like to mix it and dilute it with the water together. I'm going to take my pre-workout and go right ahead and do legs and then get ready for my facial. I'm obviously going to wash my makeup off for my facial and then I'll get back to you after the gym. I know that shit's dripping. <laughs> I look like a jelly donut. <laughs> this is my post micro needle facial. I know it looks crazy. She did some extractions here and here, so I have some new spots there. But by like uh, the first week, everything's gonna be much clearer. But yeah, this is my second session and I'll update you guys tomorrow on how my face looks. Probably still a little bit red, but I'll deal with it. You know, the first time around, it gave me really good results. So can I wait to see the second time? I know my face looks absolutely crazy right now. Um, I didn't film yesterday, but... I'm filming today on Monday morning and this is almost day two at um, 6 p.m. today it'll be officially day two but it's a lot more darker now but my skin is really dry um, this is what happened last time with the extractions um, I had more marks but like literally the seventh day all these dark spots were like gone but today i am going to go to work with my boyfriend he's bringing me to work so it's bring your girlfriend to work day <laughs> um today i'm probably gonna go shop for bedding i didn't film yesterday because i was busy shopping and we had to do some paperwork so i went shopping for a bedding set and i ended up shopping for a bunch of other things at home goods i literally went for a bedding set and we didn't even get a bedding set we got like a bunch of different stuff like we got new pots we got um utensils to cook i also got some organization um bins for the fridge and i'm always watching these tiktoks of people organizing their fridges and i want to be one of those persons that are one of those persons one of the people that are super organized because i am super organized but now that i see that all this stuff is trending is like okay now i can be like on top of my game like <laughs> i have ideas i have inspirations i have you know all these um tiktok saved so i could buy all these things i had to go food shopping today so i'm gonna do that and i have to go get bedding and i have to go to home depot i feel like i've been shopping every single weekend and it does not end <laughs> i keep buying and buying and buying but literally like i said i'm starting from scratch so i have to buy every single piece that I need. I'm speaking a little bit lower because my man is still sleeping so I don't want to wake him up. So he's getting up soon and we're gonna have breakfast and head out to go to work with him. I'm probably not gonna film that because I don't know it's not interesting you know so it's just gonna be me and him in the car. <laughs> uh, yesterday was not that interesting so I didn't even film. Um, I literally just went shopping we watched movies halloween movies uh, speaking of halloween um did you guys celebrate halloween i feel like this year was very um weird for me i don't know i saw everyone out and celebrating halloween and i was just not in the mood for it but i hope you enjoyed your halloween weekend and had fun and if you stayed inside i hope you enjoyed that too because that is also fun but um yeah i'm going to make breakfast right now
shopping haul it's not big but I've been shopping every single weekend here and there trying to get everything that I need for the apartment I know Halloween ended like just this week but I swear to you I am trying to take hold of every single Christmas decor before it's all gone because I know people are so quick to take all the freaking pretty stuff and then leave us the ugly stuff. But you know what? I'm ready for this race. Look at these cute stockings. I cannot. They're so cute. Everything that I, I'm going to show you guys is from Marshalls. I've been shopping at Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Target, and Home Goods. These are so cute. This is for me and this is for my boyfriend. And he was like, I don't really care about stockings. And I'm like, you know what? Fine, I'll put one back. And I was like, um, so I guess you don't want the stocking and I'll put it back. And then I was like, I only have one stocking for myself then and put it up on the wall. And he's like, all right, fine, get me the stocking. Look at these cute pillows. They come in two. They only cost like $25 for two of these pillows, which is a pretty good deal. But it says homemade, warm and delicious gingerbread bakery. Cookies, cakes, breads, Mrs. Claus secret recipe how cute and then the other back one is just stripes it's this one is just plain and then this one has the gingerbread bakery thing on it i love it it's so cute i got everything from marshall's not target i use the extra target bags that i had i got bowls to put in the wall how cute i don't know where i'm gonna put this yet but i definitely want to put it on the wall or on the doors I think the doors would be really cute because I have a lot of doors all around in the main area of the um, apartment. Oh, I got dispensers, soap dispensers. I have two of these. Um, I'm going to put soap in them today and use them. But they're um, glass. Super cute. Mittens. Christmas mittens. Oh, they're super cute. I love them. I'm definitely going to be baking a lot during Christmas because I want to bake Christmas cookies and Christmas goodies. So, as you can see, I love Christmas and it's my favorite holiday out of all holidays. I got this mug. It says, All the Jingle Ladies. It's so cute. I don't know if you can see it, but I hope you can. And it has a bell on it. How cute! I needed this to clean up the floor because my dog... He tends to eat like half of his food and then put half his food on the floor. Anyone that has a bully knows that they are messy eaters and drinkers. So anytime he eats, I get down on the floor and sweep it up. I got a avocado case to keep your avocado fresh. I eat avocados like every day, so I needed this. <laughs> sprinkles for when I bake for the holidays this is everything so far but I also got a bedding and bed sheets I'm gonna make my bed right now I haven't had um, new bedding since I moved in so I'm super excited to throw my bedding on with my blanket throw blanket throw a throw blanket oh my god I almost forgot I that's not the only thing that I got I also got a strainer. I needed a strainer. A baking dish. Muffin tray. Cookie sheet. A large one. Um, obviously, I'm going to be baking a whole lot. And a cutting board. 
All right, so now I'm gonna put everything away and then I'm going to make my bed and show you guys that. So let's go make my bed. You don't know I'm stalling Cause you love to have them all crying mm -hmm. Gonna be sweet day Tell me you need me But I'm from a city that's high school I give them the cinema I go uh, Cause you a bad man If she don't love man If she break ass real fast like con man Wanna swim down to the deep end Wanna know all my secrets honestly Can you keep it real cause honestly I can closet um i have yet to put my clothes in a closet this is the hanger that i got from ikea i'm gonna open that up so that i can start organizing them i love how they are wood material like the closet <laughs> Done this before you fall. I won't catch you, don't know I'm stalling. Cause you love to have them all crying. Mm -hmm. Gonna be sweet, day. Tell me you need me. But I'm from a city that's high school. I give them the cinema, I go. Uh, Cause you a bad man, if she don't love money. She break ass real fast, I can't run. Wanna swim down to the deep end. Wanna know all my secrets, honestly. I still have a bunch of summer clothes and I just put them away. I felt like there was no reason for me to hang them up if I'm not going to wear them. So I need to go shopping and shop online or something. So now I'm just going to chill for the rest of the day because I am on that monthly friend and she is draining me. So I'm going to just chill on my couch. So it is... An hour before we head to the gym, we're having a sushi as our pre worky worky. <laughs> we're having sushi as our pre workout and some chicken teriyaki. Um, hopefully, this makes me feel better because I feel super low energized. You know, that time of the month be getting me. <laughs> You yeah, give me the chopsticks right now. Dooch! All you see is his tail. Such a mess over there. Don't even look over there. I completely forgot to film and drink in my pre workout, but I'm about to head out to the gym. I had creatine one scoop and prolific one scoop. Um, this is the company that I'm affiliated with, Peace Science Supplements. If you would like to use my discount code CRUISE to save, go right ahead and use that to support me. And I'm going to go do shoulders now. I'll catch you guys later for my outro. So I'm going to end the vlog here. We just got back home and we ate at my boyfriend's family's house. So now we're back home. I'm going to shower and get ready for bed and just chill out but please like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video so stay tuned